Hello MechWarriors, how is it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior Online. Today guys, we are playing a little bit of an abomination. We are playing the Sun Spider C, And we have a lot of missiles. To be clear, this is not an optimized build or anything. I just wanted to have some fun just lobbing a million LRMs at my enemies. This build has some major flaws and I will go over them uh, very quickly before I actually get to the benefits. First of all, we are running six LRM-15. We can only fire two at the same time, so our damage will come out in waves and waves of missiles. That means that the enemies will probably have some time until they get the missile warning to get back to cover, and then the stream of missiles will at some point just be cut and a lot of our missiles will actually hit the ground. Secondly, we don't have active targeting acquisition gear, no tag. We also have no passive uh, ECM counter abilities, electronic warfare counter abilities, no beagle active probe or clan active probe in that case here. So we are completely shut down if an enemy either scrambles our sensors or has an active ECM somewhere in the outskirts and we cannot target them. However, watch the second game to the end. There you will see some interesting stuff happening. On top of that, we are completely relying on our four Four double heat sinks in the engine so we have a total of 14 10 on the engine four outside of it uh, or actually also in it but uh yeah the mech is a little bit spicy it's toasty so at some point you will run hot and then you cannot fire your weapons anymore but i guess that applies to all builds in general but on the flip side we have we have 6 LRM-15 for a whooping alpha strike of 90 damage. Again, we cannot really alpha because of the heat scale limitation here. Um, however, um, if you get into a nice spot where you can see an enemy and you can lob your missiles on them and they are otherwise uh, occupied, not shooting you, you can deal so much damage. I also like that the Sun Spider is... First of all, pretty fast. It's running 81 kph. So you can get into a nice position like behind the major firing line in the flank of the enemy. You can reposition very, very easily with the guy. And then there's one thing that a lot of people are, are overlooking or look over. I don't know. Um, which is it is a tall mech. It has long legs, as you can see. So you can shoot over your the heads of your friends with ease and that in of itself is pretty good because then you can stay within the pack and you can just shoot your missiles above their heads and uh, suppress the enemies when fighting in a nice team cohesion this is a thing that i really like about the sun spider it's height and uh, yeah all of these things are high mounted and it's perfect talk about the skills here before we go in uh, I have maxed out cooldown on heat gen so I can fire as often as possible. I didn't go for velocity uh, and that's mainly because I forgot. <laughs> it's really good. Take it. I would even go as far as losing a bunch of skeletal density points for it. We want missile rack and missile spread and high explosive obviously since our main weapons are only missiles. Bit of survivability in form of armor hardening and skeletal density. Uh, and then on top of that we want every point of cooling that we can get. So cool run, heat containment, bit of hill climb so we can get on the high ground rel relatively easily easily and then target decay because we want to hold the locks for as long as possible but if we are getting targeted radar deprivation is helping us out as well as double uav so that we can get some locks so the idea is that we go somewhere we drop the the uav and then fall back a little bit so that we can then shoot the enemies with our lrms indirectly and again double cool shot because the build is again super duper spicy that is the build everybody i wish you all a lot of fun in the shenaniganery today and if you have that don't forget to leave a rating subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right guys first game of the day we are playing the um kenya network we are playing domination and yeah i want to see i want to see my little guys go somewhere and i want to help them out they are taking off more to the right side of the whole situation here and you know what i'm gonna go with them so i have a, a shorter distance between me and what they are doing so i can lob my missiles onto the enemy's heads without them being able to retreat and if they just uh, try to take cover by hugging the walls, they are getting attacked by the light mechs. So I think this is going to be a win-win. I think this uh, could be very beneficial for both of our sides. So we're going to try to move around here and probably shoot into the Charlie 4 Don't area. Uh, yeah, that's uh, where we have some enemies already. Should I? I don't think I should expose myself too much. Actually, actually, can we hold this? No, we cannot. Not yet. Not yet. We're going to get there, guys. We're going to get there chill yeah they have probably have rated deprivation as well uh we got a mad dog here coming with us and yes that's the target boop, boop, boop. so that's a triple shot coming out all of the missiles hit i believe question mark i don't know i don't know uh my friend is going aggressive okay all right 
Uh, yeah, that's a problem, of course. We have the direct firing guys doing things. Marauder, get wrecked. Uh, yeah, he dove down. So, what about our light mix? I don't know. Man, this Mattock is aggressive. It's crazy, dude. Absolutely crazy. Problem is the peekers. If they have somebody here. Yeah, just like that. I cannot contest them. But hey, it's fine. So, I'm here. I used my 81 kph quite well, but now we are completely stretched out, and that is a huge problem. So, what is the battle plan from this point on? I mean, getting into the center, a little bit low-ish ground. Yeah, I think we need to. Let's go with the bush worker. 500 meters diable, perfect target. If we can hold the logs, which we cannot, not right now, not here. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's closing in. And he will probably not like that. Keep the locks, baby. Uh, at some point, I will probably try to get my own locks. But right now, I don't want to face the dire wolf and the axum. Uh, we need to soften them up first, right? That's my job right here. Okay, they are pushed down back to cover. And we have the team with us. That means we can now move. And we will on the axum. Rup, rup, rup. That's the pattern. Okay, on the dire then. Okay, again. I think we will be in this fight for a little, so it's probably totally viable to pop the cool shot already. Marauder 4. Oh, this is so nasty. Uh-huh. And a little bit more. And a little bit more. And a little bit more. <laughs> okay, okay, so this is where we are kind of falling back. Okay, they are trying to fight themselves out of the situation there. I wish I had better cooling. I really do. What we need is another UAV right here. Daya, get wrecked. Getting attacked though. Okay. Um, that's fine. I can take some damage. There's a guy right behind me. He's on me? No, not really. Get out of here. Good. So, on whatever that is, the Axum is there. A little bit too early with my shot, but we hit him anyway. Uh, we need a UAV and we need it right now because enemies are closing in from the sidelines. That's some close range missiling here. Yeah, we have him. He needs to fight himself out of the situation now and he realizes that. Because, yeah, he's pushing around. Cool shot it is. Uh, enemies behind us again. We need that guy though before we can turn around. Which is gonna happen now. Mm, we didn't get the Axum. Not yet. Not yet. I need another UAV ideally. But hey, let's go around. Target. This guy's toast anyways. Target. Yeah, let's let's get into team cohesion. We want to be in the middle of the pack and uh, try to get something done. This game is not over yet. It's not over by any means. Give me that lock. I want to help. Nah. Lost the lock there. Unfortunate. There's a guy right left of me. I know. I know. Oh, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made, man. It's Cyclops and he's fresh. How? All right, lost half the weapons. Ah, okay, he took cover now. Um, question is, where's the rest of the team all of a sudden? Yeah, buddy. Kid Fox, need help? All right. I need a lock. That's what I need. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So, uh, we need to be extremely careful. I don't know if the Cyclops is above us still. I don't know if the Marauder is alive still. And I believe the answer to both is yes. We also only have 400 missiles left. So, yeah, there's the guy. Okay. Cyclops is alive. We're gonna give him some more missiles. This is what we can do. We wanna try to help out as much as possible, softening up the big boys, which are not really able to dodge it because they are rather slow, but they have light mech support, and that is a problem. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, Blackjack, let's have some fun. I'm gonna try to keep you locked on... My missiles. And that's a spider coming in. I'm, I'm alone. Um, let's see. It's an incubus, by the way, not a spider. Uh, I want to try to dive down and break line of sight completely. Let's see. Okay, so we need... Um, friends is what we need. Cyclops is going to come in. That's the spider. Spider is legged. Here comes the incubus. That's the cyclops. All right. Hey, Cyclopsy. Hit my center, please. I need my side still. And yeah, we are not gonna kill him. This is not what we are here for. 
<laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Fine. All right. Can I can I delay that to get help? It, no, it's not possible. It is not possible. Heat level critical. Okay, we dodged it. And this is where we go. I really tried hard. I tried so damn hard here. Okay, we dealt like a thousand damage. Sure, yeah. I mean, granted, it's spread damage. It's spread damage. This is the strength of a missile boat. We're here to set the enemies under pressure, to soften them up. Not necessarily getting the kills. Um, but yeah, it's a thousand damage. So that's cool. Um, tried my hardest here. I really feel like we could benefit from a heatsink or two, but that would mean we're gonna give up some firepower. I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe... No, no, no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play it again like that. That was actually quite fun. Okay, so Viper, our last guy here. Uh, actually, not the, the last last. Spectre Russ. Okay. Pirate's Bane is trying to get something done. I don't know. Sneaky boy? Sneaking up? Oh, let me see. So, there is a... Uh, why the chain fire? Oh, oh because... Huh? You got heavy machine guns, ear, medium, and small lasers. Dude, you gotta do something. Uh, the timer's running out. Com Corporal Adrian Shepard. Yeah, so by now the Viper is dead. We have a no-cap stealth situation here. Um... You gotta disable your stealth buddy unless you wanna survive and just keep your kill-death ratio up and running or whatever. He disables stealth. Very nice. Oh, there he is. It's takeable. Definitely takeable. Uh-huh. Uh, he's gonna he's gonna take the kill. Alright. That's pretty good actually. That's pretty good. There's a guy on his tail, and it was a hyper assault, dude. GG, though. GG. That was fun. So, yeah, we have a wall of missiles that we can lob on the enemy's heads, but first of all, we need the locks first, and uh, secondly, this guy is spicy. It's getting quite hot. Nonetheless, we got about a thousand damage done and 600 taken, and again, I was trying my hardest to support a team as much as possible. Um, it wasn't enough yet but maybe in the next round let's go over to this one and see how this will go down all right guys second game of the day playing hibernal rift and we are playing domination so yeah where are we going i would say charlie 3 is a good spot to actually attack enemies on and i want to try to go around into the charlie 4 area want to try to minimize my distance between us and them but not too close because then we'd obviously we'll deal no damage anymore so let's see if we can find some unaware enemies that we can lob some missiles on uh yeah like a dire wolf oh that's a stalker it's way better but now we are on the d wolf and we shall stay on the d wolf oh yes we're gonna keep our own line of sight here all right oh god this poor guy uh he gave up right yeah he's just not even trying oh my freaking god he's also lagged now and this is where we are kind of hard and we should probably chain fire our way to victory and uh, he's dead okay shouldn't have taken that much damage internally not for this but the greed was strong in this one <laughs> okay so that's cool uh we got a thousand meters there ah uh, yeah why not close the distance here why not okay scatter shot is also getting missiled i'm gonna give him a nice barrage while we are moving forward but that's about it only lbx's only two lb2s uh, sorry, three LB2s. Mm, difficult spot here now. Target oh, that's... Acquired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to be there in Charlie 3, but there there's a sniper dude, the and there has the scatter sh shot. Let's move around. I mean, we have speed. Might as well use it, right? Scatter shot, lock onto the guy. Uh, and or the assault mech, which is still here somewhere. If it's a sniper, we got a bad... Bad problem. It's another dire wolf. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Yes, let's go. Left, right, thumb button. Oh, ho, 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 and then we're gonna hold everything down. Left, right, thumb button. Can we hit him from here? We can. Left, right, thumb button. Cool shot, cool shot, cool shot, cool shot. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Cool, so there's that. Uh, we are now raining death upon the enemies from here on the Axoma. Never mind, never mind. That's way too much. I can probably dive down to cover and do the same thing from the safety of... Uh, my indirect position. That's the dire wolf, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Left, right. Ah. Okay. God, we got so many missiles. That poor guy. Look at the rain! 
When it rains, it pours. What are you firing at or fighting there? Okay. What 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 are you calling assistance for or from or with? Oh, people are running. I gotta run with them. Okay, Axum, let's go. Uh, yeah, it's still a hit, but I am not in a good spot here. We need to drop a UAV right here to tell the people if there is somebody coming up to the Charlie 4 area. There they are. Let's give them just a missile warning. Okay. I hope that that is enough to push him back and keep us a little bit safe. We just need a little bit more room here. And there's a stalker. Can we? Nah, not from here. But we gotta go around completely, because look at the enemy's positioning. I need to not be in their face, because I cannot do anything against them. Desperada! Okay. Woo! Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, not with the dish here. A bit more distance would be nice. Ooh, we are playing the Dance of Doom here. Uh, there's a guy. That is a good target. It's not really. It's a waka. Hello. I'll eat your MRM so I can dish out some of my LRMs. We want to try to stay uh, on target. We got something gone. Done. Done, gone. Ooh, assault mech right in front of us. Another UAV right here? I don't think we're gonna do that. It's the Axum from earlier. I want that side torso, ideally. Okay. Uh, get that stone rhino, man. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Getting around here. Come on, friends. Uh, I need a bit more mobility. That's the guy. All right, we got him. Fur per perfect. I wanted to say it's perfect. Uh, UAV here. Desperada. Let's go. Got some damage in. Didn't open him up yet. That's my arm. No. Don't. Piranha. Blah. It's not good to go up against a light mech with those LRMs, but we gotta do something, right? We gotta do something uh, on the Desperada. Never mind. I think we won. Oh, here's the piranha. <laughs> uh, is he gonna come around? Left, right? Okay, let's go for... Yeah, let's actually go for it. Yeah, you know what? No, never mind. You have the piranha. I'm gonna have some fun with whoever is left here. What are you firing at? There's a guy. No missile warning for you. I'm just shooting my missiles dump fire in your direction. Uh-huh. Are you just standing still? Hello. Uh, so either he doesn't care. God, this is awkward. Or he is not able to do anything. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> the dump fire in the end. Oh, that was fun. We don't need a lock to fire our missiles. If the enemy is just standing like that... We just gotta go for it, especially since it's such a big target. That was a fun run. That was amazing. We got zero killing blows, but hey, we got the kill most damage dealt. We set the enemies under pressure. We had 900 damage uh, and 250 taken. I take it. Guys, that has been it for today. That was the Sun Spider with a massive amount of long-range missiles. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.